Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to go from this to this. Hope you enjoy. Let's get right to it. So today I'm going to be using my 350 palette by Morphe and it looks like this. We all know what it looks like by now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do, I already primed my eyes, so I'm going to start out with this shade right here as my transition. The next shade I'm going to go into is this one right here with the same brush. I'm focusing this color right around the same area that I did my first shade. Um, I'm kind of being really messy with it because I want more of that blown out look when it comes to the, orange, the more warm shades. I really like it blown out. And I want to add some more orange into this, so I'm going to take just a little bit of these two shades right here mixed together. Now with the same brush, I'm going to be taking this creamy creamsicle shade and just soften this out just a little bit on the top because it's getting a little bit too wild. Who am I kidding? It's still going to look a little bit wild. The next shade I'm going to go in is with this one here. Just that in my outer corner. The next thing I'm going to do is take my liquid eyeshadow by Stila. This is in the shade Smoldering Satin. And we're going to give ourselves like, I guess you could call it like a half cut crease. The next thing I'm going to do is take a deep brown from the palette and focus it really more in the outer corner, like to um, just give it more dimension than what it has right now. I'll also be doing a little bit of a wing eyeliner, but I'm just focusing that just in the outer corner. I'm going to go ahead and do my eyeliner. It is the Tardis Liquid Eyeliner in Black. Okay, so I did my foundation and my bronzer and contour off camera. If you want a foundation routine or anything like that, let me know in the comments below and I'll get it done for you. Now, we're going to finish up the eyes underneath. So, what I'm going to do, take my flat definer brush and this brown right here. And stamp that on my lower lash line about halfway in. Okay, so we are going to go in with any of those light transition shades that we used before and soften and blow that out on our lower lash line. And use that cream school shade and this brush right here. This is really going to allow us to blow it out. I'm going to go ahead and do my brows and mascara off screen and I'll be right back. 
All right, brows and lashes are done, and I'm going to go ahead and do my blush, which is Tarte, um, Tarte's Feisty. For highlight, of course, I'm going to go in with um, MAC Soft and Gentle. For my lips, I'm going to go ahead and take 1995 by Gerard Cosmetics. And that is it for this look today. I hope you enjoyed it and um, let me know what you'd like to see next. Hope you have a wonderful night. And for those who are snowed in today, stay warm. Have a great one. See you next time. Bye, guys.